I would have to describe myself as a rancher, a cattle producer. The family land that we have, that I am allowed to be able to do this on, we acquired during the land run. And so it's over, it's been in our family for over 120 years. Peggy actually has been, uh, since she was very, very little um, in, in the horses. I was involved in horses years ago, and, and this is how we kind of ended up here. 43 total acres, part of what used to be 2,000 acres that belonged to my wife's family, her mom and grandparents. We have 500 acres here, and we're at RMK Farms. My wife was born on this place. You know, we want to keep it in the family. I'm very proud that this uh, piece of land has been my family for, uh, I'm the fourth generation to be raised on it, something that I wouldn't trade for anything. This whole operation is what feeds my family. You know, it, it makes a living for me. What the cows have planned for me that day depicts what I do. I saw the OERB commercials about the good work that they did and uh, just thought, hey, we've got a piece of land over here that was an old abandoned well site eroding away and it's not fit for anything. And, and I did a little research on the computer and uh, saw that uh, the people that they had done work for before were happy and uh, that they had nothing but good things to say about them. What would it hurt to give them a call? To have OERB come out and do what they did, I mean, you're looking at the plans on paper, it's you have no idea. But boy, when you look at what they've done, it's just massive, it's just unbelievable. The damaged land that was there that had been just left and abandoned, it's now become a bunch of grass, you know, that I can ultimately use to make money. Because uh, grass kind of equals dollars for me in a lot of ways. You gotta take care of land they don't make anymore. People today should have OERB to come in and, and check them and, and get that done because it's just a wonderful thing. It's not just a piece of land over there washing away and uh, going to waste. It's turned acres that were uh, unfit into one of the most uh, beautiful spots on the property as far as I'm concerned. I would tell anybody that was skeptical in regards to calling OERB uh, in any way that they shouldn't be at all. Uh, this has been a process that is by far one of the easiest things that I have dealt with uh, in this kind of avenue. The best part is it's free. <laughs> so you're not gonna get any argument out of me. You know, this whole plan out here is for the grandkids to be able to enjoy and then, you know, their, their kids and just generations to come. That's what we were doing. And then here comes OERB and, and their plan's kind of the same thing. But here they are helping us accomplish that plan. I mean, it's fantastic. I'm glad that we've uh, stuck it out through the good times and the bad, and because uh, it hadn't always been easy, but we have, and, and uh, now I have this piece of ground, and I'd like to see the farm grow again, and uh, I'm just really proud that my roots are right here. People don't know me from Adam, you know? And uh, so for them to come in like they did, spend the amount of money and the amount of time and the effort that they put into it, make my place better is amazing.